Hey, what's good, Magic Gang? Welcome back to my channel here at Magic Guide the Team. All right, if you don't already know, because it's your first time clicking here, I am Maji and I got the tea, meaning the truth, the tech. All right, the tea. And um, over here, I do tower readings, inspirational videos, motivational videos, pick a card, collective readings, and zodiac signs, okay? So if you're into that, don't forget to subscribe, share this video. Today is another important message, as you Maji Gang know, all right? So this message is, is for somebody that literally may not know it or needs this confirmation. Your security has been breached. That's what I kept hearing, okay? Invasion of privacy. So there has been an invasion of privacy. And this message, your ancestors want you to know this right now because you need to protect yourself. You need to protect your home, your environment. I don't know if this is happening in your office, in your home, but I'm really getting at somebody's home. But if that's not your situation, it could be somewhere else where this is happening, okay? But there's an invasion of privacy. Now, I'm not talking the government. We already know what they do, and we already know nobody here got privacy. This is a different thing, right? This is an invasion of privacy from somebody that you know, somebody that you might be working with, somebody that could be blood-related, somebody that is somehow in your inner circle or you know from somebody from your inner circle right this is not like just some random stranger is what i'm getting here to be specific however i am going to use tarot and other oracle cards and my very own oracle cards to get to the t and decipher this message so again going back um, i'm hearing your security has been reached comment below no weapon from against me shall prosper god please protect my home God, please protect my passwords, my bank accounts. Comment below, everything that is mine is safe. Everything that I own is protected, okay? My energy is protected. My home is protected, okay? Anything, your money, because somebody here is trying to get into something, and I'm hearing, obviously, this is happening without your consent. So, first things first, let's discuss. I'm getting that, first of all, you need to look around your house. Let's start in your home, okay? This is for somebody here that you could, you're already sensing this, I'm getting. You're already sensing this. You've already gotten this message. Maybe you didn't take it as serious. Maybe you thought that this wasn't you, or maybe you didn't take action, or maybe this is the first time you're hearing it. Whatever the case may be, do take what resonates, leave what doesn't. But first things first is you're going to need to go around your house and check if there's any cameras, right? Because I remember I was on like, this was a couple months back. I'm sure you guys, um, some of you guys have heard of this. But I remember that there was a TikTok video of this mom who had found a camera in the shower of her daughter, of her 16-year-old daughter, by her own husband, which is the daughter's stepdad. And he was like invading her privacy as she's showering because clearly he was a freaking pedophile clearly he wanted to see her uh his wife's daughter like naked and stuff and she says who knows how long this has been happening because she's never seen this before but it was stuck inside a shower inside the shower head so who knows how these people these experts or these people that have done their research place these certain cameras it could be in a teddy bear it could be in behind a wall something's bugged if it's not a camera i'm getting your house is bugged Okay, and if you're struggling with this and you need some clarity, come below. God, please show me who is hacking me. God, please show me who I need to watch out for. Okay, like show God to give you some type of revelation is what I'm getting. You need to be on prayer mode. You need to be on prayer mode so God can tell you what is going on. For some of you, this may not even be technological. Okay, somebody could have invaded your privacy in the spirit realm. They have been trying to get access to your astral body, to your avatar, and um, they're trying to now intervene into your thoughts. They want to know what your thoughts are. They want to know what you're thinking. They want to know what your memories are. This is very much higher, and if that's already resonating, you do need to book a, a private reading with me because I'm not going to use that part here, especially because I know that they are watching me. You know, they really don't like psychics. We tend to expose the shadow people. So I am getting some about some governments. I'm definitely doing that to you because you're somebody very significant and important, and they need to know what you know. So there we go. I'm going to start this reading, if you don't already know, with my very own Oracle deck, The Chosen Ones 144. Okay, this is my very own Oracle deck created by me and Spirit. You can purchase this on my website at MyGigaTheT, and the link is also pinned in the comments or in the description box if you feel led to this. This is for people that feel chosen, that feel like you're psychic, you're a healer, you're a shaman, you're a starseed. 
you're something, okay? And you need some guidance. You need to activate your past lives, your ancient knowledge. This is going to help you, okay? And especially if you feel like you're chosen, but you don't have that protection or that guidance, it don't matter. These cards are literally your mentor, okay? And to those of you that already have this, make sure you pull three cards out of this as I'm doing the reading to see if you get the same cards as confirmation or for it to give you some more deliverance, okay? Um, so on the bottom of my deck, we clearly got enemies. You got enemies, got a lot of enemies, got a lot of people trying to drain you of your energy, honey, okay? Shout out to Drake. Listen. Oh, yeah. Happy birthday, Drake. I heard it was like his birthday or something like that. Shout out to my Scorpios. Happy birthday, Scorpio. This person could be a Scorpio or you could be a Scorpio. But listen to this, okay? You got enemies, like I said. And these enemies around, around you are trying to watch you. And I'm getting a very specific message about cloning, okay? This could be literal cloning, depending on the industry, depending who's watching. Celebrities could be actually cloned right now. Some of us know this conspiracy theory. This might be a confirmation if you really have this conspiracy theory. But for the most part, I'm just getting like, imitation is the highest form of flattery. So I'm just getting like a lot of people or this specific person is obsessed with you, first of all. If you don't know who this person is, I will guess specific and I'm going to use the King of Aloha classified deck. Somebody here could work for the CIA or like I said, is doing something like that, like government. They work for the government. They're doing something. They might be a cop. They're taking advantage of some sort of power that they have with the law or the government or uh, something like that, right? But I'm going to be using this classified deck to find out specifically who, if this isn't if this isn't detail enough, do book a reading with me. You can email me or go to my website, okay? Everything is pinned in the comments, guys, and everything is in the description if you ever need to book a reading. It's very self-explanatory. So like I said, I was getting this message of like just impersonators, just of copycats, frauds around you, people that are trying to literally sign your name on not just contracts, but on your money, on your, you know, I'm getting like, identity thief or something i'm getting like this invasion of privacy is like somebody really wants to get the tea on you they want to in one way or another after they get this they want to show it expose it project it maybe even publicly for others another message is what i'm getting is like they're watching you or hearing you because again your phone could be bugged your house could be bugged or it could be literal cameras or it could even be monitoring spirits okay like high level psychics high level warlocks who have already mastered astral projection conscious projection and they might literally be always like watching you i'm getting cleanse your mirrors okay guys please cleanse your mirrors you can use florida water after you properly cleanse it spiritually cleanse it and lock your mirrors because this might be another way that they could be spying on you i'm getting there's people with these clairvoyant abilities or they're using individuals with clairvoyant abilities to watch you because yes you mean something yes you're very important you might not know your role here in this world but there's a reason why this is happening happening at a higher scale governmental and for others of you by some people that are very just close to you okay you got enemies around you and these enemies want to know your tactics they want to know what you're doing how you're doing it if this isn't your home that is tapped or your phone i'm getting somebody's trying to hack your emails or act your actual phone i'm getting are you seeing like a green light have you been seeing a green light like around your walls or on a certain technology, bro, I'm getting a green orb. I don't know if you guys are seeing it. It's right here. Like it's right there with my fingers pointing. I'm seeing it. Whatever. You know, shout out to my psychics out here. Let me know if that's you. But comment below. Nobody is me. They cannot replicate me. I am one and only one in a million. Claim who the hell you are, honey, because you got copycat. Bam. And this is in the family. If you want to get specific, you got copycats in your family who are trying to impersonate you. People at your workplace, people in your neighborhood. I don't know who this is for you because this is collective reading, right? But you have spiritual surveillance, people watching your, your astral body, okay? I'm also getting your ancestors have been watching their every move your ancestors have been hearing the thoughts their private thoughts that they're having about you that they might have like telepathically been sending you harm before bed or when they wake up i'm hearing you're the first thing they think about because it's this competition energy i'm really getting i'm getting your ancestors have actually recorded these enemies inner thoughts their actions and everything that they're doing from the from this earth realm to the spirit realm to the point where all you got to do is be like ancestors please show me the movie show me the records and press play 
So literally set your prayer, start working with your ancestors so they could just show you the clips. Comment below, ancestors, show me the clips, okay? Show me the scenes, show me the recordings, show me the evidence. I'm getting they're going to show you spiritual evidence. You know how? Especially through your dreams. Pay attention to your ancestors. A lot of your ancestors, guys, have been trying to communicate with me. And if this is your first time watching, stay tuned to my previous readings. I have been confessing everything that they've been trying to tell you, right? So again, you got people here or person enemies. This could be one or many people who are watching you, who have planted cameras, who have done things, right? Who have tried to hack your mind, your spirit, or your actual property, technological thing. However, this is working out for you. You have a spirit team that is protected. If you believe this, comment below. I am protected. No weapon from against me shall prosper. Their plan will backfire, bro. That's what I just heard. These enemies' plans is going to backfire. You want to know how I know that? Bottom of this deck says judgment for your enemies. They're literally about to receive judgment. Boys and girls, they're about to get judgment for playing with you. Because I'm getting your under surveillance bro you're under surveillance this could be illuminati secret societies for someone here specifically too it says someone is watching your every move somebody's being recorded keeping tabs on you spying on you so like i said it depends on your situation your home situation somebody's literally has cameras on you bro Secret cam. So like I said, first things first, start looking for cameras, download the app, do something. If you know somebody that's an expert on them, hit them up. If it's not your house, you've done everything, then check your phone, check your office, check something, check your car. Because somebody, you're under surveillance, bro. You're being watched. It's your every move. Why would they want to fiend and obsess to watching your every move? Well, because they want to be you. They're trying to impersonate you. So they're studying your character in a sense is what I'm getting. And the more they study your character, the more in their head, since this person clearly has mental issues. No, no disrespect to anybody that does. I'm just saying like clearly something's wrong with this person, right? And their soul. Because it's like, why are you being so petty to fucking want to watch me? Now, this is somebody that could have cops or this person could be a cop or have some affiliation to the law. This person thinks they're above the law. They know what they're doing is illegal, but they know they have they have illegal protection is what I'm hearing. This is somebody that has, like I said, illegal protection, a judge, a cop, somebody in the legal enforcement, somebody in the CIA, somebody in the military. However big this is for you or however small, right? This person might even be involved in the police they they don't have to be a cop but they know some cops or somebody in a high position here and they have illegal protection so they know like listen i know i could get away with it because in fact this cop could have helped them do this this person in this legal enforcement could in one way or another show them in fact how to put this in your in your house More simple you know we've watched all those spy movies right i'm really getting like you are being watched over comment below god please show me who these people are reveal them to me i am ready to receive this message okay they've been putting false reports have you been getting like random cops knock at your house for no reason and then you're like whoa they're like, like maybe saying something that like neighbors are complaining but that never happened this is happening i'm hearing like they're spreading fake news about you and stuff like that okay <clears throat> yeah then we got deja vu something here is just gonna seem familiar to you sound familiar it's gonna activate a memory of some sort here mm -hmm. okay so let's see what else is going on here this person has like it's reckless is what i'm hearing this whatever this person is doing is reckless they're spying on you really really hard and they're using their legal connections like i said they know people so they know that they can bail themselves out. This could be somebody in a high position of power. They feel superior to you or to whatever they're doing. Yeah, remember I said these are the witches and warlocks? Somebody here has these clairvoyant abilities and they're using it also to, to send witchcraft to you, right? But to also spy on you in the spirit realm. Comment below, I am protected. My spirit is protected. My soul is protected. My astral body is untouchable. Like, hello? You literally need to understand the power of affirmation. You already have enemies around you. The best thing to do is to speak lovely things into your existence. Because you're a powerful witch and warlock yourself, right? But you're a light worker. And this is why you're being attacked. This is why people want to copy you. You're doing something good that they want to copy. They want to imitate the way you look, the way you talk, the way your eyebrows are shaped, the way your nose is shaped, lips. Like, this is literally like, I'm getting like some Kim Kardashian shit. 
when Kim Kardashian came out, how many people are still trying to be Kim Kardashians and they literally go get surgeries? Like, you're a trendsetter in this way. You got you got impersonators here. You might literally be on television, right? Or I'm getting checked the back of your TV. You might something might be happening to your television that's gonna give you uh you know, maybe you're hearing some taps or something, some sound coming from your from your TV. I'm really getting that. Mm-hmm. But look, a pact. See, somebody here is not working alone. They could have made a pact with the devil here. Could have made a pact with some type of secret society. This person wanted to, this person didn't care about losing their soul. As long as they can take whoever you are. It's crazy. You're literally that powerful. That somebody here literally preferred to lose their soul and sell their soul to the devil. In order to replace you, comment below, I am irreplaceable. In order to, like, take your own, like, your life, your energy, your your gifts, whatever it is, okay? Tell me what else regarding this invasion of privacy. Somebody here could actually work for the government. If this isn't you, this person, like I said, might work for the government or have connections with somebody in the government or somebody in power. I'm really getting that. Have you been having sex dreams? This won't resonate with everybody, but I am getting like, if you are having sex dreams, first of all, you need to get a tiger's eye. All right, get some tiger's eye. This is gonna protect you. And get some clear quartz because it's gonna give you clarity and it's gonna like remove, remove that confusion that you might be dealing with. So if you're having like sex dreams, this is part of the spells and the distraction that's happening, okay? You're this is this is how you know people are trying to manipulate your energy. We have grave magic, okay? Somebody is sending death wishes towards you, okay? They're using their rage and anger to channel negativity towards you. Somebody here is definitely like wishing your death. Let me know if you're having dreams or seeing bats. Are you seeing bats? Um, or have you been having dreams with like dead people or uh, soil, um, owls, things like that? Like I said, this person made a pact with the, with, with the devil. So they're just trying to channel dark energies to send to you. Have you been feeling this darkness around your house? Make sure you're cleansing your house, cleansing yourself, protecting yourself in prayer. Whatever is your belief, go ahead and do that, okay? But this person wants you to be in chaos and confusion. They're trying to attack your mindset. Tell me about this invasion of privacy. They might even, like I said, they're to the point where they want to see what you dream. Like I said, this could be some high level of, of superior power here for someone too. Because I'm getting, it's, it's not just one of you. This is happening a lot. This is happening a lot. Okay, guys, please take heed of this message. They know that you're somebody that is a receiver of great messages from God in the universe. And this person, they're trying to hack your dreams, bro. Comment below. You cannot hack my mind. You cannot hack my dreams. You cannot hack my spirit. Yeah, a realm jumper. So this person wants to transfer their karmic their karmic energy to you. They want they want you to, to literally have their karma and they won't have it. Comment below. I do not accept their karma. Their karma's not allowed in my temple. It's really not. And they really try. Look, a crime. There we go. They're trying to cover up the crime. They know what they're doing is a crime. Committing unwarranted acts of violence in the physical and spiritual. That's what I'm saying. Right now, you're already being attacked with witchcraft. That's that's here. They're setting the candles intentions, going to graveyards. They're they're talking to water deities, doing their sacrifices. Listen. These people go get what's coming to them. Remember, they're getting judgment. Comment below, karma's coming to my enemies. Comment below, watch out. Watch out. They better watch out. Okay? These people are, they have an agenda with you. They're trying to cover up their crimes. They know what they're doing. These people could actually be in a ring of criminal things. I don't know. This is, I'm getting like, for some, this is just even bigger than you thought. Okay? You need to have your amulet of protection. Like I said, get a crystal, get a necklace, something that you can anoint that can protect you. Okay, then we have moon faces. We are going to have a full moon very soon. So use the moon faces for the moon to reveal to you what you need to know. Okay, because if you're psychic, the moon is going to reveal things to you effortlessly. Like for me, I don't have to do nothing. I just go to bed or if I just stay up, I see it in my third eye. I see everything people do to me. I just don't tell them. You know what I mean? I just don't tell them. But I know all the fuckery they do. Then we have abundance. Okay. So somebody here is trying to maybe like.
take something that's yours. This could be your spiritual inheritance, your actual inheritance or property. It's like there's some form of abundance that's going to rain down in your life. Comment below, money's raining in my life, okay? I have, a, I have, a, I'm manifesting a blood of blessings. I accept, not blood, whoa, blood. Some of you, this could be blood related. I said flood in my head, but then... Yeah, so it's a flood of blessings, but yeah, it's going to rain down in your life anytime now. Comment below. It's anytime now. I'm about to get this money anytime now. Yeah, they're doing, I told you it was family. Look at this, competitors. I'm telling you, they're competing with you because they want to dim your light. They want to take your spotlight. They want to be better than you. Guess what? They can't be better than you. Comment below. You cannot be better than me. They cannot be better than me. There's just something about you that is untouchable. And no matter how much they try to replicate, it's like, bro, you're never going to be me. Never. No matter what you sacrifice or who you sacrifice. I hope you take heed of that. You watching because you know who I'm talking to. Then we got Coven. So like I said, these are a Coven of Witches, Warlocks. This is like a group that is, is, is helping this person, okay? Or this person themselves have this gift abilities to, they're watching you through like their crystal ball or some bullshit like that, right? And like I said, for some of you, for a large portion of you, this is your own family or your person's family, somebody's family, okay? This is family related. That's why her blood. So for someone here is really your direct blood family that is invading your privacy, <clears throat> so be careful about that make sure you're securing your home make sure you add your own cameras in your home make sure that you know um <clears throat> you're changing your locks make sure that you are protecting your home yourself your spirit your work okay do some clearing uh spell work here do some cleansing that's what i'm really getting but you will be liberated from this comment below i will be liberated okay i am free from any negativity, period. Any curses, comment below, I am curse free. Yeah, this person, they just, oh, look who they're working for. <clears throat> if you're working for God and they're working for this creature, like who you think really gonna win? Look at that, who you think is they gonna get karma? They gonna get karma. They gonna get karma for working with this creature. Who you working for? God, comment below, God hire me, who gonna fire me? Let them know who you're working for. Comment, comment below, God hire me. Who you working for? God hire me. Who gonna fire me? You're not working for this. This person, yes, they did make a pact with that being, like I told you. They definitely did. And they gonna get karma. Because guess what? They working with a... They going against a light worker. They're going against somebody definitely who is able to remove their own curses effortlessly too. So they have a voodoo door is also what I'm getting. They torture you in secret with this thing. This is somebody that hates you or they might be super jealous of your beauty for someone here they're just really jealous of your beauty the way god made you naturally um they're jealous of your looks they really they're doing beauty spells on you is what i'm hearing and all this is gonna backfire comment below all this is gonna backfire okay so you know if somebody here does know let us know in the comments below, how do we go about finding out it to see if there's surveillance in our home, in our property, in whatever way we're being watched, in our phones. Let us know, somebody here that maybe works in coding or tech and is very tech savvy. Let us know in the comments, how can we help ourselves out? Because shit, I like to know and I'm sure it will be helpful for a, for a lot of us, okay? So yeah, let's use the classified deck for the CIAs out there spying, right, secretly. <laughs> not funny though but yes for someone i heard a shapeshifter this is somebody that's like a shapeshifter okay yeah they're trying to do some type of like humiliation ritual towards you like i said maybe use this yeah like i said look the enemy is targeting you comment below i am protected from enemies for someone it's your best friend for someone here, you need to watch how your best friend put cameras on you. Look at the camera right there and it says best friend. Okay? This could be somebody younger than you is what I'm getting. Okay? I'm also getting neighbor. Okay? Beware of your neighbor. There could be a neighbor, like I said that earlier. Yeah, somebody that could be obsessed with you or something like that. This neighbor maybe wants to invade your privacy because they want to know, like, <clears throat> what you do inside the house. What kind of person you are. What your job? Yeah, maybe they heard you're divorced, or they're trying to make sure that you get divorced, so they take your spouse. Listen, it could be anything. This, it's a freaking big world, and everybody got different lives. It could be your best friend obsessed with you. <clears throat> Who is this person? 
<clears throat> somebody wants to watch to see if you have a, a secret child or something like that. They want to know a secret, a secret about your child. Yeah, for someone here, it's a past friend or a friend. Okay, yeah, they're plotting schemes. I'm getting plotting schemes. And I'm getting something about divorce because this ring was on my finger and I kept feeling it more and more. Something about that, okay? Tell me more about this invasion of privacy. Who specifically is doing this for the collective here watching here and now? Okay, so like I said, this person is like doing something online, trying to hack. And again, guys, I don't know if you do know because, you know, I haven't said this in a little bit, but I do have fake impersonators on TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, any platform really. They have created a fake Majigata T and, you know, they try to add you and message you or comment in the comments below telling you something like, that's not me. I'm not going to solicit any readings. I'm not going to contact you, hit you up, be like, hey, book a reading. I feel this energy from you. If you want something from me, then you can come and reach out to me. I don't chase. I attract period i manifested life facts and maji got the touch honey so i don't need any of that yeah i got the maji touch okay stranger for someone here it could be a stranger <clears throat> somebody that's trying to bind you to a soul tie i'm also hearing i'm hearing like top secret something here is being done top secret because you you're whole you're the secret of something here you might not even know you're some you might not even know you're somebody's secret child okay like somebody powerful that's another download i got so Put yours where they're at, all right? <clears throat> but yeah. Any other messages? Yeah, somebody here is like very nosy. They're trying to like search, look you up. They want to know more about you because of jealousy. They targeted you, okay? So, for some of you, this could really turn into a crime, which is why Spirit is warning you, depending on your life and your level. All right, Spirit is saying, listen, this can turn into a crime and this person can cover it because they have protection from the law or somebody that they know, right? It's already a crime that they're invading your freaking privacy, first of all. And let's not talk about, you know, bigger days out there watching all of us, us knowing that they're already invading our shit. But anyways... Don't forget, guys, to join me on Patreon, too, if you like exclusive readings. You can just join me. The link is in the description box. Okay, that's exclusive tea, honey. That's where I kind of talk about government and stuff because it's my Patreon. Anyways, Archangel Michael is working at Help to Help You. Your name could be Michael. We have indecision, okay? Like, <clears throat> you might not even know if this is your reading or not, but I'm getting like this is. They're trying to confuse you to make you feel like maybe I'm just losing it. I'm getting like somebody wants you confused, like... Am I really bugging? Because I really feel like I'm being followed. I'm being stuck. Am I bugging? You're not bugging, okay? They're trying to cross this into this indecision. You on are a healer, okay? So they're trying to just take the energy off this healer. Like I said, somebody important, somebody related to the bloodline of Jesus. Comment below. I am related to the bloodline of Jesus. And like I said, there's a contract coming up. Somebody here could have been signing your name in a contract or something. But listen, all is being equalized here. Remember, God is the true equalizer. And so the scales are being balanced. They're going to get their karma. You're going to get your good karma. Um, there is a contract coming that is going to bring you abundance. Somebody here could have been born on uh, 1986 or August 6th. Okay. Yeah, look at that attachment. Somebody, like literally, somebody might have sent like a, a spy, like a spiritual spy to just attach itself to you, which is why you've been in this confusion no, 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 what decisions to make, indecisive, unknown, like maybe fear of the unknown. This contract I'm hearing is something, you're going to be doing something that you love and you're going to be quite good at it. It's something you're very confident in. Yeah, but like I said, the moon, the moon is going to reveal to you Cancerian energy. The moon is going to show you, this full moon is going to reveal, okay? And you might watch this on the full moon if it's not today that you're watching this. This is a timeless reading, but I am getting that, um... This people they want like revenge. They're they just feel hurt 
and they're going to be using the moon and Halloween and all of that dark energy. All the witches, all the warlocks are going to gather and they're going to go against you and they're going to send you more and more energies and more curses. Comment below. They have curses cannot touch me. My spirit is untouchable. My energy is untouchable. You cannot access my data. That's what I'm getting. They're trying to access your Akashic records, your spiritual data, but also the information here, where you work, what you do, and how much you make, what you wear, what you dress, what do you go do your hair, your eyebrows. I mean, I don't know how, what level these people are, but I'm getting, just think obsessed. Just think obsessed. And <clears throat> like I said, these people just really want to see you hurt. You might have already been hurting from something that you're going through. I'm, I'm getting you're going to heal. But this this full moon, use this energy to do releasing as well. Like I said, the moon speaks of witchcraft and things that are being hidden. So you may not see this. But the moon is also speaks about intuition. So trust your gut. Is this your video? Is this something that you've been feeling? Even if it's a bit of it, it's better to look into it, right? So anyways, this is your message here, Maji Gang. Thank you so much for watching. I really just had to release this video. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much, everybody. Until next time, okay? Peace, love, and light. Bye-bye.